Hi, you guys. Welcome back to Fake It To Make It or Hi, if you're new. I have not done a weekend to-do list in a few weeks because I have been so busy, which doesn't really make sense because you would think the busier you are, the more you need your planner and a list, but that doesn't seem to be the case. So anyway, today I will be um, creating a weekend to-do list, and I was looking through my stickers, and I was looking through my Yay Season sticker book, and I came across this hot tea, frosty leaves, and sweaters, please. Yes, it's with the Christmas stickers, but I don't feel, this is kind of a, a wintry sticker, and I know it's still fall, but you guys, it snowed twice here in Michigan this week. So I, this is what started this spread, and then I pulled a couple stickers from last year's Winter and Merry and Bright sticker books from the Happy Planner, and um, yeah, so it was kind of all inspired by that color. I have some washi from Paper Source that I'm going to use as well, and I think I might actually stamp too. So I just feel like, I don't know, I feel like having some fun and kind of getting into it. Okay, first, I think we're going to use a little bit of this, like, knit, cable knit, kind of sweater, scrapbook paper. Let's use my... And I will have my Amazon storefront linked in the description below if you're interested in any products I use today, like my little Tombow. It'll be linked down below. I think I want another one up here. Let's, I'm going to match it though, so I think we're going to... I mean, I want the sweater pattern going the same way, if that makes sense. So I'm just going to snip the edge, though, because the edge has, like, that little bit of the perforation and I don't want that. Oops, so we're just going to trim that off. So I know a lot of you are still like, it's still Thanksgiving, it's still fall. And it is, and I love fall, but I don't know, something about it getting like so cold and it's snowing here and the snow didn't stick. It was just like a light little flurry, but it just, I don't know, kind of has me in the mood for doing a winter spread. I was going to say in the mood for winter, but that is 100% not, not true. I'm not in the mood for winter, <laughs> but I am in the mood for a winter spread. Okay, next, I brought out the stamp. I want to use that. Um... And then I have all this washi as well. I think I really want this up here. Again, because the, the idea of this is that um, this will be a weekend to-do list. So I do want plenty of room to write. This washi tape is so pretty. I love the colors. Oh my gosh, this makes me want to decorate for Christmas. I know, I can't help it. I'm just ready for it. Although it's probably not gonna happen. Not just yet. I gotta take my fall decor down. But honestly, I'm, I'm kind of ready for it. 
I just love how pretty it looks. The, it's like so cozy and the Christmas lights. Just very lovely. Okay. Um, a little bit of green, all the stars. Is that a little too much? Hmm. I really want to use all three of these. I'm just, I don't know why I'm feeling like I want all the all the stuff. Okay. And then I definitely, I think I'm going to use this green. I have, I got my black ink out too, but I don't want it to be so harsh because these are lighter colors. Um, I think we're just going to pop that in the corner like that. And then let's see here. I think we're going to put this down here, but I'm going to put some washi down first. And then put these little winter skaters down here. Okay. And then I do have this and it has some Christmas presents and they do, I mean, the gold does kind of go with it, but I'm thinking of cutting them off again. Like I want this to have a winter feel, but I don't necessarily want it to have a Christmas feel. So I think I'm actually going to cut these off even though they go with the color palette just because I feel like it definitely gives off some some Christmassy vibes if I do that so let's put this over here um, how far over do I want it maybe Okay, and then, let's see, I pulled a couple boxes, as long as this, uh, along with the sweater and this little cup of hot cocoa, so. I think. Yeah, kind of like that. And then I have, I need to make tweezers. And then maybe we'll do a little more washi tape. Ah, okay, let's see. Hmm. I don't want to go too right there. Let's get this. Hmm. No, I don't like that. I don't know why I don't like that there, but I just don't. I kind of wish I would have put this under this box. 
So are you guys still decorating your spreads with fall stickers? Have you busted out any winter or Christmas stickers yet? Or are you waiting till, until December, or at least until after Thanksgiving? And also, like, what's the weather like where you are? I was kind of surprised that it snowed already this week. I mean, I shouldn't be, and these things happen here, but it still surprised me a little. I don't think I like that little cup there. I know I'm going to be covering that, but mm, I don't know. I don't know I'm having a hard time with. Placing that. It's the same place. I don't know why I'm not liking that there. Is it this I'm not liking? There's something here. I'm just. I think maybe it's this washy. Maybe it's just a little. A little too much. I don't know. Alright. A little better. Hmm. Let's see. Let me just put that on my... I also have... What else came with these stamps? What does this one say? Enjoy the now. But it looks like... Very much looks like kind of a a mail stamp, doesn't it? And I did it upside down, of course. Hmm. That is going to bother me. Okay. We are going to get a piece of sticker paper and we are going to redo that is that yeah that is definitely gonna bother me okay I just need a piece big enough oh, it's not exactly the right color though shoot Okay, let me, let's look in these sticker books to see if I can find something maybe to cover it up. Okay, I have this winter fun day sticker. That. won't entirely cover it up, but I don't mind that that little, those pieces are sticking out. It kind of looks like part of it. Mm, I think we're going to leave it. I do want some dots or some kind of structure to write. I'm going to test out. So I have this piece of scrap paper here. I have these, um... What are these? Zig, Zig color dot markers. Um, I have, I will have a link for these down below, or you can also find them in my Amazon store. Maybe we'll use these. We'll do every other. I think that's good for there. And then I don't know if that would be too many. Maybe at least right here. Maybe just not put anything up there. I think that's fine. And then I think I'm just going to use a little washi. Maybe just put the tree on the back.
and just do very simple on the back. So I will use the back of this. There we go. Oh my gosh, this washi is so pretty. I love the pale colors. I love that it's a little um, not your traditional Christmas colors. I think it's really cute. Peel this up. I've really been enjoying using stamps and I have some alcohol inks that I have had for a while. Um, I've never used them in my planner though. So I would definitely, I don't know, I definitely want to try that out. Okay, enjoy the now. Let's make sure this time we have it going the right way, which we do. Um, and then we're just gonna pop that up there. With just a little bit of washi. Nothing crazy. I just want it to coordinate with the front a little bit. Nice. And now we're ready to fill it in. I'm going to bring you guys closer. Okay, so I'm going to start over here with my shopping list. Brussels sprouts. Espresso pods. Olives. Ham. mustard. And I can also fill in in between. I don't need to go just by the dots. All right, so there is my shopping list. And then things to do tomorrow. Take down fall decor. And I'm going to put inside Take down fall decor outside. Um, let's say put fall bins away. So it's a whole nother thing. Once you get it down, get it packed in the bins. Oh, and I still have. <laughs> washi tape. The bins need to go back into storage. Um, so that is, I would like to fold and hang laundry, which I think I will do um, when I'm watching a movie or a show tomorrow. Um, I would like to clear off my disc. Mm. Let's say clear dining room table. I 
get some games, put away games that need to go away that we hit out. I'm just going to put clear clutter in dining room. Our dining room, because we don't use it, kind of becomes a dumping ground. So that needs to go away. And actually, I think I am going to add a couple more dots because I want to add some things that I want my kids to do. Um, so I think I might just... do that. I am really loving these little zig markers. I might I wish it came with a black one. That's my my biggest complaint. I wish there were um I wish there was a black. The gray is perfect though, but black would be even better. Okay. Oh, sorry. You guys right frame. Okay. So things I need my kids to do. Have kids put away shoes. I don't know if you guys have kids do all their shoes like congregate like it's some kind of mass at the front door. That's what happens in my house. So they need to put their dang shoes away. Um oh clean cat litter needs to be scooped out. That is their job. One of them needs to do the dishes. The other needs to take out garbage and re, we'll just put recycle, the recycling. Perfect. All right, and then we have going to make this a work bar box charting. It's, someone had once asked me, so now I feel like I have to explain it in every video because I just assume people know and obviously you, you don't, you may not know. Charting is the notes that I have to write on the patients I see. So I've gotten a little behind. Week of 11. Okay, and then here we're going to write to plan, and we have my classic, my skinny, and my social media, though I also want to do my girl with goals, which I did not use this week, to be honest with you. And it probably would have helped me stay on task better, but I just never got to it. So that is the side. And then this back side I'll use for any errands or anything additionally that comes up. Oh, actually I do already have something. I'm going to write it on this side. But first, why, oops, let's use my fun little zig dot. Oh my gosh, I this I like this so much. Um, I want to wash my truck. Vacuum truck. Um I want to wash windows and put new mats in my truck. I got new, um, like the rubber weather mats at Costco, actually really cheap um, for $23. I bought them a few weeks ago. They've been sitting in the back of my truck. I want to get that done, um, before it really starts to snow and stick. And then it ruins the carpet in my car because I don't park in the garage. So, 
And then as anything else comes up, I can add it to the list. We can go ahead actually and we can just dot this all the way down. Uh, we'll do one more. And then we can do this side as well. So anything else that comes up, I can throw on if I just, I don't think I need a full grocery shopping trip this week. Um, but if there's anything additional, I can add it to the back. And this will be something that I work off of all weekend. Um, it doesn't necessarily matter when this stuff happens, just that it gets done. And yeah, I think it's really cute. I love the winter vibes and I love the, the sweater, like the texture of the sweater scrapbook paper. Let me know down below what you guys think. What you guys are into this weekend. Are you having a chill weekend? I've been asking on social media and it sounds like everybody has been overworked, a little overwhelmed, and it sounds like a lot of people are looking forward to a relaxing weekend. So I hope that you are doing something that you love this weekend, whether it's being with family, relaxing, doing something fun. Let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time, guys. Have a great weekend. Bye.